In this video, I'll demonstrate how you can manually adjust the layout of the score. As you enter notation in Sibelius, it will automatically create a format according to the density of the notes in each bar. You'll notice in the score here that there are five bars on systems one and two and six bars on the final system. You can override that setting in various ways. The auto breaks option will do a custom formatting for the entire score. This is a big time saver and the first step that I usually take. Go to the Layout tab, choose Breaks, Auto Breaks. In the Auto Breaks window, check Use Auto System Breaks. The default is four bars per line. You can set it to any interval that you like. Click OK. Sibelius has added layout icons, in this case for Auto Breaks, a dashed arrow. You can also manually create changes to the layout of each system. For example, if I want to move this bar, I would select the left bar line and in the Breaks tab, click System Break. The shortcut is the Return Enter key. When I click that or press the Return Enter key, that bar moves to the system below. You'll notice that the layout mark has now changed to a solid line indicating that a manual adjustment has been made to that system. You'll notice that that change created a single bar on the last system. I'd like to move this up to the system above. To move a bar up, you must click and shift click to select the group of bars that you want placed on the same system. Click in the first bar, hold down shift, and click in the second bar. Go to the breaks tab, and choose Make into a System. You can also go to the ribbon and type the word Make and look for the option Make into a System and it also displays the shortcut. Sibelius now creates icons to indicate where you have used the Make into a System option.